solve log base 2 of x squared minus x minus 2 equals 2. Writing this in exponential form gives us 2 to the second power equals x squared minus x minus 2. Now 2 squared is 4, so we've got 4 equals x squared minus x minus 2. And this is a quadratic equation, so we want to get all of the terms on the same side so that we can solve it easily. So we're going to subtract 4 from both sides. This gives us 0 equals x squared minus x minus 6. And we can solve this by factoring using the unfoiling method. We need two numbers that have a product of negative 6 and a sum of negative 1. Those numbers are negative 3 and positive 2. And when we set each of those equal to 0, we get two solutions, x equals 3 or x equals negative 2. Now there's one thing we have to do to make sure that these are both solutions and not extraneous solutions. We know that the domain of logarithmic functions is all positive numbers. We need to make sure that when we substitute these in to the inside of the logarithm, the result is positive. So let's take a look at what happens when we plug in x equals 3. We've got 3 squared minus 3 minus 2. That's 9 minus 3 minus 2. 9 minus 3 is 6. Minus 2 is 4. And that is positive, so we know that that fits with the domain. Then we'll try x equals negative 2. When we do that, we've got negative 2 squared minus negative 2 minus 2. Negative 2 squared is 4, and when we subtract a negative, it's the same as adding. So we've got 4 plus 2 minus 2, which gives us 4. Again, this is positive, so we don't have any problems with the domain. And these are actual solutions. And so x equals 3 or x equals negative 2 is our final answer.